Hey guys, so I have a really quick impromptu video. That's why I don't have like my regular setup on and I'm just kind of not looking like my, my freshest, but I just really wanted to do this video for you guys because I've never done one of these and I really like watching these and so uh, I thought this was a perfect time. So what you're going to see is an unboxing video. It's basically me just unboxing a box I got in the mail. Um, I really, really had to buy something from this recent sales on Hot Look. I know I'm in like a no shopping buy, but none of it was makeup, so I'm not breaking any rules, but I am cutting down on this, but I just really want to show you guys this because I'm really excited to open it, and I've never opened it before, so I've never even seen anything yet. I just cut the tape off of it, so I'm eager to open it to them, so let's go. Like I said before, both are from Hot Look, and I'm really excited. I got two packages from Hot Look. Hot Look shipping takes quite a while depending on the what sale it is, it actually really varies on the sale. One of them, it only came in like five days, and the other one I ordered like three weeks ago, so it really varies on which sale it is, like how long their shipping takes. First, if you guys don't know what Hot Look is, flash sale. So if you love a brand, let's say like you love Lucky Jeans, and you want a pair of Lucky Jeans but you don't want to pay full price, there will be a flash sale where um, on this website, Hot Look, I'm just using Lucky as an example, I think they've even been there on, on there before, um, like at 8 a.m., you will go on and there will be all these, like the things that are current out right now, even them things that have been discontinued and they will be for a cheaper price, but they'll be for a cheaper price because they'll only be there for a certain amount of time and that's literally probably like three days. But the key thing to Hot Look is you've got to be like an aggressive shopper. You have to be there on there at 8 a.m. when the sale starts if you have something you want and you add things to your cart. And this is my little Hot Look tip. Don't scroll through and add things as you like. Don't scroll through and decide what you want then add them because you can always take them out of your cart. So if you see something you kind of like, add it because someone else will get it and then it'll be sold out because it's all very limited quantities so you won't get everything really fast but basically you can sign up for their emails you'll get emails every single day I have it on my cell phone I get app on my phone so I get reminders of when it's coming and I set reminders on my phone I set my alarm like I'm very very into Hot Look it gives that whole like thrill of the shopping buy it reminds me of like Black Friday like finding over clothes but it's on the internet but um yeah I am obsessed 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 with Hot Look I've said it a hundred times it is my favorite website I've gotten all of my friends addicted so I will have the link to Hot Look below but it's basically me unboxing a couple things I got from Hot Look and um okay and the first thing I got are these Buco, Buco, and their shoes. I completely forgot I ordered these because these ones took a really long time. But they're so cute. They're just, wow, I really like these. These are really cute. They're like these like brown fringe sandals. Let's take this out. I don't know, it's a tiny bit of a wedge. I like them. They remind me of like my Steve Madden's, but a little darker. And they've got like the toe hole, which I really like. They're really cute, the buckles. They smell like really, really leathery bad but I don't know I like them those are cute I think those were also around like $20 I think which is like really good for like nice sandals especially when you have yeti size feet like me holler size 10 11s holler and this package is one I'm most 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 excited for I ordered from the Rebecca Minkoff sale if you guys don't know I already have a Rebecca Minkoff bag it's actually right here this one the little mini mac um I love I love 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 her bags and they went on sale and if you guys are following me on twitter I was like up at like 7.50, I like had tea to wake myself up, and I was on there like picking bags and putting bags in my cart, and um, I ended up staying on there for like two hours straight, refreshing, refreshing, on the getaway clutch page, uh, and um, I like got it to my cart after like an hours, hours, hours of trying, because I kept refreshing it, said I did it was in someone else's cart, I did it in someone else's cart, keep waiting, and so I finally like it, like was like add to your cart for like a split second, I clicked it and I got it. So this is the getaway clutch by Recommend Cough. Um, this is originally $495. My butt's ringing. Hi! I spent $295 on it, which is a lot still, but um, I saw this and died and fell in love with it, but I'm obsessed with it. It's a taupe clutch with rose gold detailing, and it has a long strap with this kind of detailing, and it's really, really pretty. And it's a, like bigger, definitely bigger than the Mini Mac, but that's it. Wow, it's pretty. So that's that one. That's the getaway clutch. Okay, and then the other one I ordered, I basically put this one in my cart too, um, just to like, because I've never seen this one in person, I've seen the getaway clutch in person, and I didn't know which one I would like more, so I put this one in my cart as well to see if I'd like it. Um, oh, this is nice. Oh, you've got tassels, I didn't know that. Suggested retail of this is $3.95, and I got this for $1.99. This one, this is all rose gold detailing. 
I don't know how to take it off, but it's like braided. This one's quilted with, okay, I don't know. Ah. Oh, it's got tassels. Those are cute. And like zippers all around. It's got the recommend cross labeling on this. This one's called the, the Swing and Mocha. What I need your help with. I don't really think I can justify in my head right now at least keeping both because they were both really expensive and like it was an impulse buy to buy two. I was not planning on buying two. I've always in my head thought I should return one. So which one do you guys think I should return? And if you don't think I should return that, tell me both two. Just because in my head right now, I'm like as I'm seeing them, I'm thinking maybe I shouldn't return one just because... It was such a good deal, and I love both purses, and if I decide I want to buy one of these purses later, I'm basically going to have to buy it double the cost, but um, I don't know. So if you guys think I should buy keep the Getaway Clutch, comment that, or if I could keep, should keep the Swing purse. So just comment either one of those, and yeah, that was just my little unboxing video. It's really small, um, just because I didn't get that much stuff. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. Make sure to check out Hot Look in the link below, and thumbs up this video if you like unboxing videos, because uh, sometimes like I'll get a box in the mail, and I will just like open it and like not even think to do one, but I don't know. I think they're kind of fun. To okay, bye!